Just for now, it's time for the beer name. Today's brew day is going to be uh, kind of interesting, kind of weird, kind of crazy, and I may fall over and die, but we'll, we'll see how it goes. Uh, we're going to be making bagels while we're making the beer. I noticed a while ago that every single bagel recipe called for boiling the bagels in water with some honey or malt extract. So I figure might as well double duty it and uh, make some bagels because bagels are pretty hefty. Uh, so I'm going to make a pretty basic beer, just uh, an English style bitter, uh, very simple. Once I'm ready to boil, I'll throw the bagels in and then bake them while I'm boiling. Uh, it'll be a little bit tricky to get the timing, but hopefully uh, I've planned ahead and planned well enough that uh, nothing will fall over and explode. Uh, the other interesting special thing that I'm going to be doing while we're making it is uh, just for the hell of it, I decided that I wanted to put some toasted flaked oats in my bitter. So while the bagels are rising, I'm also going to toast some oats. Let's see how it goes. So I've got some flour, some white sugar, salt. I have olive oil instead of vegetable oil. Hopefully that doesn't mess me up too badly. Some baking yeast. I think this is actually the first time I've ever bought baking yeast. I think uh, this looks pretty good. I'm going to lightly oil another bowl. Just gonna roll with this thing. Cover this, set this aside for two hours to rise. So we finish the uh, the bagel dough. It's off in the corner, rising. Uh, so I'm preheating the oven now, which I probably should have done earlier. And we're gonna toast some oats as soon as that's done. All right, uh, oven is preheated. I'm gonna lay the oats out on this thing. Do you want to use your pan on that? No. Okay. And give them a nice light toast. Yeah, so um, I just changed it from the bake setting to the broiler because uh, I realized that uh, only the bottom element was on and I really wanted some heat from the top, so I set it to a low broil. And hopefully, I don't light anything on fire. Some of these are starting to uh, to get a bit dark and hopefully maybe not burn, but I'm getting a little worried. The broilers may be too powerful for this, so I'm gonna grab the mitt and pull them out now. Ooh Those are toasted. Not quite as even as I wanted, but I guess that's the side effect of using the broiler when I wasn't expecting to. Um, lesson learned, probably put it on the lower rung and uh, 
stir it more. However, this looks pretty good. Doesn't taste that bad. It smells better than taste. Hopefully this will make an interesting addition to my English bitter. It's the gong show! All right, at this stage in the game, where my oats are toasted, bagels rising, we're mashed in. Uh, this is gonna rest for about an hour. Uh, at about an hour and 17 minutes right now is the time of the bagels. So um, we're gonna let this sit, then the water and sparge it, and right after we're done sparging, we're gonna punch down and start shaping the bagels. Um, it's all going fairly smoothly. Nice looking mash. It's actually a lot darker than I was expecting it to be. I guess that roast barley goes a long way. <laughs> but the subsequent batches should lighten it up just a little bit. But, you know, I kind of prefer my, uh, my English bitter a little bit more on that end than, than the traditional lighter style. I think it's going to be maybe not too style or too tradition, but it'll be something that I'll enjoy. Bagel time! Oh, it's bagels! It's the food of legend. And breakfast sandwiches. Alright. 
Give me your lunch money. Oh, I love the noises that thing is making. Um, I punched it down, I guess. Bagels are rolled. These are going to rise for another 15 minutes and then they're going to get boiled for one to two minutes aside in my uh, balloon wort here. And uh, then we're going to bake them at 475 for like 15 minutes. And uh, then those will be cool and I can just continue brewing the rest of my beer as normal without any of these shenanigans. But this has been a fun adventure and so far these are turning out um, like bagels, which is surprising. Mm -hmm. I was expecting panic and failure, but I, I'm here to have baked goods, pre-baked goods. Directions say to put these in three at a time, about a minute to two per side. Here we go. UK Challenger. 60 minutes. It's half hour into the boil, well, 45 minutes into the boil, half hour before the end. We have an addition of the rest of the Challenger and some Kent Goldings. They are UK. Uh, I accidentally spilled a little, so I'm going to use the shorter one here because the Alpha is a bit higher on the Challenger than I was expecting. So, and a one. And a two. So with 15 minutes left on the clock, one half ounce can Goldings. And Or chiller. Pretty much uh, 10 50 on the button. Looks like. These are really good bagels. Yeah.